Hello, this video is going to show you how you can use the Microsoft translation provider for Translation Manager to translate your entire site almost instantaneously using machine translation. So Translation Manager is built in with the idea that you can add additional providers that will do different translations and here I've installed the Microsoft Translator API. So in order to use this you need to have an Azure account and set up Microsoft Translation API on your Azure instance and from that you will get an API key and you can put the API key in here and then Translation Manager can send any text it needs to send to your Microsoft Translation instance and get the translated text back. As if by magic I've now got a Microsoft Translation API key in there which means when I go to my translation sets and do my settings I can choose either none or I can choose the Microsoft Translator API to translate all of my content and now when I go here I can choose a node, do send translators before, let's do the Welsh node and submit the translation job and this is going to go to the Microsoft Translator API which is slightly different than the other uh, translation providers in that it does instantaneous translation so in submitting the job it's actually doing the translation at the same time so you can see the job's been submitted and the translation hasn't come back yet but that's because it's doing the translation now as opposed to submitting the job and then coming back so it will probably take maybe 10-20 seconds because it's going to translate all 24 parts of the site but when it's done that should change there and we should have a little tick and our entire site will be sitting in received so there you go that's gone so we now do OK we go to here and now it didn't go it went to submitted but it's gone straight through to receive because of how the translation has already happened and so you can see there's our 24 nodes pre-translated if we go into any one of them we can see all of the translation has happened where it's possible to translate and we can either go through and select things we might not want translating, we can select all items and we can approve and publish and that will take all 24 pages extract the content, put it back onto the Umbreco nodes and publish the nodes so this is effectively republishing our Welsh site now completely Welsh and if we go here reload it all, here you go the entire thing is now in Welsh <laughs> 